it is Tuesday the 2nd of August 2022. We're all going through a cost of living crisis at the minute. Everything's going up in price, uh, fuel in particular. Now, um, we are not entirely uh, immune to those changes, to those costs. We have, after all, two vehicles to run, but we use them sparingly, but we need to buy petrol and diesel for them and recently diesel was almost two pounds a litre. Uh, I remember just a few years ago when it was a pound a litre. So prices are going up and one of the areas which has directly affected us is actually the cost of animal feed. The cost of wheat in particular has gone up by 25% uh, and we get through up to four sacks of feed a week. That's a lot of money. Uh, and it also means that if we're relying on feed from uh, that's manufactured that we have to buy in, then we're not exactly self-sufficient. So one of the things that we're going to start doing is trying out the chickens on feed that we can provide for, for them from local sources. So today we're going to try them on rowan berries. Uh, these are in abundance at this time of year. Rowan is sometimes called mountain ash. You've got lovely orange berries, uh, orange scarlet berries and uh, we occasionally pick them for making into jellies although it's a bit of an acquired taste because they're, they're quite bitter. But we'll try them out on the chickens and hopefully they'll be happy to eat these rather than the much more expensive wheat. In fact, it'd be so much more expensive if they were eating entirely wheat because we have to buy all of that. Whereas the, uh, the rowan grow on trees that we can pick for free. So, these are rowan berries. And as I say, completely free. It's, we're not sure whether the chickens are going to like them. So we're going to find out today. Right, one bucket full. Hopefully, they'll like this lot. Right, well, I've scattered the bucket of berries. The goats seem to like them. But I'm not convinced that the chickens and ducks are happy with them. Some of them are starting to take an interest. So I'm not going to say it's back to the drawing board on this quite yet. Uh, we'll see how they've done when I come back a bit later. Uh, hopefully, but, oops, it's been pushed over by a goat here. Uh, we'll have a look when we come back later and uh, we'll be trying other berries as well. The whole berries will be ready soon. But I've got plans for uh, wormeries as well, uh, and they're useful. Uh, the worms are, are useful for feeding to them because they are high in protein, which the hens need to be able to produce the eggs. 